All right, back from that flawless Exodus victory. Triple Armageddon. What, what, what does this setup do? A lot of things. It's a lot of why it's good. Yeah. It has the new pressure to break a lot of setups up, uh, and it has the awesome drone damage and projection that Dominus is bring without mm -hmm. quite as much tracking. So, It uh, does a lot of two things. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. It does oh. other things. <laughs> It well, does those two things really well, though. Mm -hmm. This is when I get to channel my, uh, my my twin a little bit and be a little smug. I kind of called that one when we saw yeah. the bands, so, mm -hmm. uh, and that's what Exodus brought, and they were very effective with it. Yeah, they flew really well. We were talking mm -hmm. about how, like, late night setup is really good, like yep. a very strong setup that maybe could have beat that team, but execution for Exodus just looks really yeah, solid. Very like, it's going to be yeah. very, very hard for a first-time tournament team to beat Exodus with, like, the way they were flying. Absolutely. That's very solid work. All right, so next up we have teams that are decidedly not first-time tournament teams. It is uh, former uh, tournament winner Hydra Reloaded versus Darkseid, who are former runner-up-ish tournament teams. Right. Yeah, they get to the semifinals a lot. Yes, um, yes. They've just been very, very solid. I mean, they're the team that, uh, like, they got to semifinals in 88, uh, mm -hmm. semifinals of 89, and then, like, the quarters of 8010, I think, something yeah, like that. Sounds right, yeah. Yeah. I don't know if it's fair to say, though, it seems like they're maybe a little shakier this year than yeah. normal. I mean, they almost went to loser's bracket yesterday in that match against Darkness of Despair, right, where they didn't, yeah, they, they like couldn't quite kill anything and got a little lucky at the end of the match. They brought a Tinker that didn't really have a way to beat other Tinkers, yeah. which is yeah. not great. And I think Darkseid have had a fairly tough road here and done really well. They beat Hunter yeah. Loaded, they true. beat Shadow mm -hmm. Cartel, they beat Darkness of Despair. True. And, and Hydra have gone through Solar Fleet, uh, End of Life, Ministry of Inappropriate Footwork. I mean, not, not bad teams either. But yeah. No, Look but at those scores for Hydra. I mean, they've lost, what, one point of ships total? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and actually, do you know what? That Ouch. wasn't losing a ship. That was just they brought 99 points yeah, to that. That's right? true. Because we don't have one point ships. Yes. That's right. Yeah, yeah. They, they've looked completely dominant in all yeah. their matches <laughs> so far. But it is true the Dark Side's probably had a tougher uh, yeah. three matches leading up to this. So. I yeah, Dark Side, I think, is definitely the underdog, but they're yes. an underdog that could upset Hydra. Mm -hmm. I said it yesterday, if, they're, if you're not scared of Hydra, you need to be, and that's, I still hold to that. I think even though their setup yesterday maybe was a little iffy, uh, they definitely learned from their mistakes well, and they're extremely good theory crafters. So. Mm -hmm. and how can you bet against Count Monte Carlo? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, my, my friend from uh, FanFest tournament, Heart SP there, he was our captain for that, so. Which you won. Yeah, we yeah. did win, yeah. we did win. And lots of yelling from Heart during that yeah. match. Heart's very <laughs> exciting. A ton, of, a ton of tournament experience, a ton of, like, Hydra just do, hasn't really lost things in a tournament in a long time. I mean, yeah. they've won all of the SELs they've entered. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, they've... Uh, Even beating PL in the final in SEL3. Yeah. So. The worst they've ever done in an alliance tournament is second. Yep. <laughs> Sounds right. So yeah, they're 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 it's a really good. strong team. I mean, what, what yeah. are the winners historically of the SCL? Uh, we've had Pandemic Legion win. We've yeah. had and then Hydra twice. Hydra, tw no Hydra won the first one. I'm sorry, uh, PL won the second one, and yeah. it was Hydra versus PL in the final of the third one. But Hydra took that one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so it's basically like the Alliance tournament. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we do have the bands in, and uh, I must say, Hydra have a pretty funny band. Uh, Dark Side banned out the Molas and the Dominics, mm -hmm. and Hydra banned the Celestis and the Curse. Okay. Well, you know when, um, it's going back to the FanFest tournament, uh -huh. when we were up against Pandemic Legion in the final of that, and they were bringing a Tinkerish setup, um, Hart put me in a Curse for that. He thought that was an effective counter to it, so maybe that's, they're going to bring some sort of Tinker and they don't want to see the Curse. Yeah, or something that requires guns especially would again mm -hmm. have that same problem as we talked about before. Uh, you might ban a uh, Balgorn if you weren't worried about uh, mm. tracking disruption. Um, it's notable that uh, Dominic's ban there wouldn't necessarily block the flagship for yeah. um, Hydra. They're the only team that brought a Dominic's mm -hmm. flag, or that submitted a Dominic's flagship. They haven't brought it to any matches yet. So, yeah. hmm. Why why, uh, why the Dominic's is a flagship? It's a really good question. Yeah. They're the only people that have done it. Yeah. Um, you can do a lot of cool things with the Dominic's. They would... Um, and the issue, I think, that a lot reason a lot of people haven't done it is because the special, like high-powered mods you can get on a Dominix, the drone damage mods mm. that are of officer level and the other drone yes. officer mods, those are just recently added to the game, mm. and they're still super, super rare. So I don't even know if like Hydra would have any. You might see some next level mm. tactics here, I mean, in the sense that they they want the Dominix. The Dominix, what it does really well is is obliterate frigates at long range very quickly, especially if you assign the drones correctly to a fast locking frigate. And maybe they just they, they were using the, the flagship as a way to not get down their one Dominic band, yeah. and they can get out there and just blat frigates off the field right at the start. Mm -hmm. I'd really like to see if we can't get someone from from the studio to tell us if we have flagships on the field because that would be an interesting development in this match. 
Uh, in terms of team quality, this this might be when you want to bring them out. The, yeah, if you don't bring out, like especially for dark side, yes. if you don't bring out your best setup as dark side, then you're doing something wrong. This has to be dark side's like mm -hmm. big moment. If they can, this is a chance to in one match get past Hydra. You don't have to worry about a best two out of three. If you knock them, if, mm -hmm. if you knock them down here, then you don't have to face them again until the finals. I just got a little sneak peek into Hydra's uh, uh, setup, and it is uh, pretty next level. Uh, <laughs> all new drones. Yeah, not, not nothing shocking. but new drones. <laughs> uh, they, they, uh, they, they, oh my, wow. Hundred and fifty million plus. Yeah, that, on means the field. Not, that means they have tournament prize ships. Uh, that means they have. Idea of what's they they probably not, have an Atana. Uh, yeah. they, they, I mean, no, 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 no. They, they, they not only have. Uh, they not only have their flagship out. They have three Malice. Do you know what? You know who else brought a flagship in three Malices last year? That's true. PL and they and lost. And, and, and apathetic <laughs> Brett. Was yeah, team Rhodes team beat them in that. That's right. Maybe, but, maybe they saw PL thought good well, setup, bad pilots. We'll do it. Yeah. Well, the, thing with, yeah. the thing with the right. Malice is it's just a nasty anti it's an amazing ship. ship. It's really scary. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right, we're, we're going to go to the match. Now. So let's get some predictions here. Hydra's going to chaos dunk right here. <laughs> chaos dunk. <laughs> I, I, I want to I say that the Hydra's going to lose this one, but I just I can't bring myself to do it. They're going to win. Yeah, I, I can't say that anyone other than Hydra is the, um, the favorite in this match. Hydra is going to, I think, take this. I think they will as well. Uh, when someone takes it to the next level and someone takes it to the even more next level, then uh, you have to win. I think Hydra is going to take this one. 